What's up guys, Paul from Golfers Authority. And today I'm playing quick nine holes here at Kenny Mac. Today we're actually gonna be trying out a new putter and it's made of wood. Yeah, a wooden putter. So the way we're gonna do it is I'm gonna use my normal gaming putter and then I'm gonna use the wooded putter and see which one is more accurate. When I first heard of a wood putter, I was like, this has to be a joke, right? But it's not. And from what I've heard, it's really accurate. About 200 yards out from the pin, at least I'm still in the fairway. So let's see if I can get this thing better off. So about a year ago, I met these guys from Canada who created what's called Greenwood putters. And I thought it was a joke. I was like, who makes a wood putter? But the story is very fascinating because they found a putter from the 70s in a guy's garage and they went to get out at the golf course and it worked like a charm. It was deadly accurate and they're like, wait a minute, maybe we're onto something here. So lo and behold, Greenwood putters. And I cannot wait to hit this bad boy because it looks really cool. So I'm about 140 yards out. I'm gonna try the eight iron. Still trying to use my new irons. Uh, I'm not sure my distance. That yeah, looks like it was spot on. I'm on the green, and let's see what this uh, where this ball landed, and check out this new putter I've been talking about. So we're gonna be doing some accuracy putting, uh, testing out the Greenwood putter versus my gamer, which is a Seymour putter. Um, seeing really how it feels, how it plays, and whether I can make putts with it. All right. So first off, we're gonna be hitting the wood putter. This is from Greenwood, and as you can see, it's wood, no joke. Um, and I'm really excited to see how good this thing is. It's quite, uh, it feels great in the hand. It's uh, soft, yet you can still kind of feel the weight on. So now I'm gonna be using my Seymour putter that is my normal gamer and let's just see the difference. So as you guys can see, they're pretty close and I've never hit that putter before. So let's check it out in the next hole. So after the first hole, I got a five, which is great for me. Um, I'm actually super impressed with that wooden putter. I did not expect for it to feel like my gamer. Um, as you can see, I just sunk both putts with using the wood one towards the end and it was very smooth. So we're on number two and let's see what happens. This is about 140 yards. I'm hitting an eight iron, hopefully over the water. Oh, That's two good shots today. I've had my eight iron. I'm on the green about, I don't know, maybe 20 feet behind the pin, which is amazing for me. So uh, let's check out the putters again and see how the green one putter stacks up against my gamer that I normally use. So I'm on the green, but I got a lot of grass in front of me. It's probably like 45 feet but well, this is actually really cool i'm really excited about this check out that divot i mean that ball just stopped do a head-to-head -head, see how the greenwood putter stacks up against my gamer all right first up is greenwood Feels really good off the face. So I'm gonna use my regular gamer to see if I do any better. I mean, they're about the same. The faces feel different. The face of my uh, gamer is a little more softer, but you can still feel the ball on, on the game on the green wood. So that's really cool. All right, so I'm gonna put out using both my uh, putters. Oh, that break. You know, use a green wood. I think it's granny. So, 
I'll take it. Playing two putters is kind of hard. Uh, I got a four on that hole, a three putted. Want to get on? Yep, three putt. Um, but it's all right because I'm just testing these putters out today and I'm having a great time with dad and his friend. And uh, we're on number three, see what happens. So I had a pretty good drive there, but I'm open the club face just a little bit because my hand slipped. So it kind of went off to the right and the other fairway, just a little bit. Still playable on the grass, but you know, I'd rather play down the middle of the fairway than off to the right. In the trees, a little chip shot here. It looks pretty good. Uh, I'm not sure where it landed, but it was straight, and I think it's downhill and there's no sand. So, it looks like I'm not quite on the green, but I'm on the good grass. All right, so I'm gonna try the Greenwood putter again. Woo! It's not good. All right, let's try a normal putter. ball down this tree line I'm kind of playing my grip lately I'm not really sure like kind of what's going on but I noticed my face is opening up more on my driver so I tried to close it this last time and uh, I hit it down this tree line right here hopefully I'll find it so it appears I'm in the sand and out in the trees so I'm gonna try to hit this thing out with sand wedge hopefully get it onto the green from here It was a pretty good out. I didn't quite make it to the fairway, or I made it onto the fairway, but I didn't quite make it on the green, but I have a good, nice third shot. So I'm really happy with that. So that was my out about 30 yards from the pin, but I got in the middle of the fairway, so I'm real happy with that. Hopefully a nice little chip shot will do. That looks like it was the right choice. We're next to the pin. Time to test out the putters against each other. All right, first putt's gonna be the green wood, the wooden putter. Starting to get used to the weight and feel of it. Now I'm gonna use my gamer, my Seymour putter. Oh. Not the bounce, but I'm happy with the shots. Wow, boy. So I'm in the other fairway a little bit and I gotta get over these trees. So I'm gonna do nine iron, hopefully, it's just the right length to get to the hole. Uh, you cannot get any more close than that. It is next to the pin. Well, not next to the pin, but close. My shot, ball landed, 9 iron was the right choice. Uh, I'm going to try out the Greenwood putter first. Oh, break got me. All right, now I'll go to my gamer. I see more putter. So. What I'm finding is that there's not a lot of forgiveness in the wood and putter. Um, something I'm not used to. So when that ball comes off the face, it kicks. You, just, you have to do actually less of a swing to get a longer result. Um, when I use my gamer, it feels that like I have a little more control over it, that the face actually absorbs uh, the impact of the ball, which gives me a little more precision on the putting. But what I can say is the wooden putter is pretty accurate. It just, I can't seem to get the ball speed off the face the way I want it. 
so I'm not sure what to do about that. Um, we've got a couple more holes and uh, we'll be testing that out um, in the last two holes of the course. So I had a pretty good drive there. Um, off a little to the right, pretty far. Still trying to get used to my new uh, setup, but I'm actually pretty happy with it. What I do love though is it's May in Arizona. All the winter visitors will have. Green fees are coming down, and you can get a quick nine in. You know, 6:30 in the morning, and you can pretty much blow through a pretty quick. And it's fun, and there's not a lot of hold up. So, just a beautiful day here in Arizona, and a beautiful day to play golf. So, pretty good drive here. Um, interesting chip shot. I got a pine tree um, and a sand trap right in front of the pin. So, I really can't go high because I'll get stuck on the tree and I'll come right back down. So, I'm gonna try to aim uh, between the pines and that sand traps right in that little gap and i might just try to punch it up in there if i'm lucky so let's see if i get let's see if i actually can do it oh oh crap right in the sand all right so we have a short putt here meets greenwood putter first oh see too much can't control that ball speed off that face. All right, let me just take a second shot with my own putter. So yeah, guys, that is a Greenwood putter. Um, it's made of wood, 100% made of wood. Uh, I am actually really impressed with it. Um, I was able to get some really good shots with it. However, some of the downsides to me is it's a much heavier putter than I'm used to. And because of that, um, I think I'm kind of over striking it which then the ball um, goes a lot further than I'm used to. Um, the one thing I noticed too with my Seymour putter is that it absorbs a lot of the impact of the ball. Um, with, the C with the green wood, it's more of a harder face. And because of that, the ball kind of comes off of it a little bit more. But some of you guys out there might already have putters like that. And this might be a good putter for you. Um, but yeah, it's legit. It's really, it really does work. And um, I'm impressed. But if you're a golfer who tends to lose things sometimes at the golf course, hence like me who lost the Greenwood putter head cover somewhere on 16 or 17 and can't find it, then be sure to check out this video right here where we check out this must-have accessory for all you guys who like to ride and don't want to lose your phone.